top players on a fitting stage. That's what we're talking about. A match of colossal importance and one that has captured the imagination of anyone with an interest in this great game of football. Now we're truly ready for what will be a showdown. And we'll have the action live on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say with good reason, it's Odisha FC up against Bochum. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, although it's down as a 4 5 1, it's more likely to be three players in behind the main centre forward. And those three are key to this team's creativity. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, they're playing the same shape, really, so it's all about getting control of that central area and which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Well, it was a superb effort and so near, Stuart. Well, it just opened up for him, didn't it? Right to take the shot on and it was a decent attempt. Well timed tackle. And well, they know they need to stop him. Plenty of support here. But nothing comes of it. Couldn't keep it. That's useful play. And a superb challenge there. And they'll be happy to have regained possession. He's in here. And there it is. 1-0. Their efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here's another look. And you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. One nil then. Goddard. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. And they've given him too much space. Chances on. Well, with well, that wanting to put too fine a point on it, that goes down as a tame effort and easy for the keeper. And well, they're not standing off their opponents in the slightest. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute.
So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. It did look on for them, but not to be. Now, who can he play it to? And foul it is then. Likes to run with the ball at his feet, but they dealt with the threat posed. Now doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Roy Krishna. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Well, he's gone back and awarded the free kick because there really wasn't much of a tangible advantage. Here it is now, a substitution. Well, they couldn't keep it. Good piece of closing down. Real chance. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. So back underway, one goal apiece here. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Effective piece of pressing. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Into the advanced position. And possession changing hands. Now options are plenty. But timely defending when it mattered. Just 10 minutes to go. A very effective challenge put in. Still pushing for a winner. Hoffman. Well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And giving it away. And that is it for the 90 minutes. Level pegging here.